Welcome to the Scorpion Bullwhip Project, Part 9. It snowed out, that's why we're wearing the hats. Um, if you just watch Part 8, not much has happened yet. Hell, I haven't even welded up this disaster. I suppose I should do that. Uh, one thing I want to show you that did appear is uh, a nice NTN bearing. And that is the 25 millimeter with a spherical outer that I need for this whole jack shaft setup. So that's pretty sweet. And then, in the box, John. Yeah, we never do package openings. All right, this isn't like viewer mail. This is something <laughs> I ordered. But let's see what's in the box. This box comes to us from uh, Remember When Vintage Sleds. And uh, that's the name of their, of their website. Look at these brand new scorpion wheels. Brand new. They're yellow. They got like some Cosmoline on them. So uh, I don't know. Somebody probably wants to clean that off. I'm not sure who. We'll let Farley lick them. Yeah. Maybe not. So that's nice. 15. So that's enough to rebuild the skid. So uh, basically, the plan for tonight is to just keep going on this. I got to get that jack shaft welded up so I can get that absolutely finalized. I can know if I need to shim my chain case or anything like that. And then I can lay out the drive shaft. So that's my plan. I don't know. What are you doing tonight, Dennis? Uh, I can clean a wheel or two. They need, they need cleaning. There's some I was going to take a lap on the TX, maybe. Should we get the TXL out? It's after dark. That doesn't make <laughs> no, for a great video. Sucks. Maybe uh, maybe when Saturday comes, we can get a little uh, TXL action during the daylight. That'll be fun. All right, so now you know what we're doing. We'll bring you back when we're doing something. I was about to go to the lathe and work on the jack shaft. The details has gone to town on these. Using the old super clean. We'll have to get in there with a toothbrush or something, maybe. I got a toothbrush. <laughs> oh, maybe yeah. we need to let them... One you, one you don't use? Yeah. <laughs> maybe maybe we need to let them soak for a little That's bit, too, and do. soften it up. Yep. Lay a few out and spray them down. Yeah. Well, yeah, you can see it's just falling right off. It's working. I think this is working. Get a little, little soak. Do a little toothbrushing. And shines right up. Ah, jeez, there's John polishing his shaft again. You caught me polishing my shaft in the corner over here. Clearing the rust off so we can weld that up. Shaft's getting hot. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm just playing with my shaft. Getting her dialed in. Getting her dialed in as close as I possibly can. to go move it to a different part shiny silver bullet approved next up is Lonnie and his handiwork get these put on here Taking a finishing cut. 
I always take the roughing cuts by hand, you know, I feed by hand, but when I'm doing a finishing cut, I do the power feed on that. So here you go. If you measure these shafts from Polaris, they run about a thou or a thou and a half undersize. And uh, this one's right there. She's good. Uh, you can see I machined it about an extra, what, inch and a quarter there, just to give me some uh, extra leeway if I need it. And uh, life's good. I couldn't be much happier than I am with this. It's Thursday, Lonnie's here. Brad's off camera petting Farley. Cheers. Lonnie wants to tear into skid. I know, the drive shaft. You want to see me make a custom drive shaft. Well, I want to do it too, but we're doing the skid tonight. Yep, skid night. So here's how it goes. Yeah, These tits are just gonna cause drag. <laughs> Don't they always? Don't the, the tits what if the, are, hey tits are always a drag. If it's got tits or tires, it's gonna cause trouble. But what about when there's tits on the tires? Mega trouble. Oh, oh, man. Faster. Mega trouble. <laughs> it's a whole nother level. <sighs> there you go, buddy. Happy to have this done. And how pretty are the wheels on the outside? They're pretty good. Yeah, they look good, man. Right on. They're not purple. They're not purple, though. God dang it. Good enough. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to call this one right there. Why do I always get an itch as soon as the camera comes on? I don't have any idea. Okay, we're, we're calling this one right there. I think you're allergic to cameras. I must be totally allergic to the camera. Where's the itch? Uh, <laughs> So, uh, sorry for doing more skid work. We know this is, you've seen the skid on three videos now, but we had to get the fancy new wheels on. You know how it is. It's like you get a new toy and you got to play with it. So, uh, with that, we're going to say thanks for watching. Thanks to the patrons, Aaron Shriver, Michael Johnson, Matt DeFosse, Charles Myers, Alex Shrell, Brandon Pariso, Dan Hosnut, Mike Jarish, Luce Brady, Jeff Eiser, Brian Peters, and Mitch Clubbo. Thanks, guys. Everybody else, check out the Patreon page. All these guys saw this video a lot earlier than you did if you're not yeah. a patron. So uh, thanks for watching. Hit subscribe, and we'll see you on the trails. See you on the trails. You should have added, we're going for a ride. Oh. Are we really going oh, for a ride, though? Yeah. Yeah, it's, thir tomorrow? it's Thursday. Or Friday, Saturday, I mean. It's Thursday in November, and we may be going on a ditch bang on Saturday. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, y'all. Uh...